Welcome to day 595 in my hex journey, I hope you're doing all great. Thanks to my latest subscriber Ryan Long, welcome to the Hood Project and please now make sure to smash the like button, let's get this video up to 500 likes, hit that subscriber button and turn on post notification to get notified for every new video and now let's get started with today's episode. Today's video will be a short one, I'm gonna give you some stats about hex, what is hex doing in the last 24 hours, we're gonna have a quick look at the last day, day 5 in the sacrifice phase where you still get the same rate. Tomorrow the rate will be already higher so overall we're gonna cover the hex stats to pull sacrifice stats new tokens were added to the sacrifice list now for example you can also sacrifice tron eos cardano or stellar lumen and i just saw maddox and poly network were added to the list as well and for demo purposes i'm gonna show you how to sacrifice cardano and tron because those tokens have to be sacrificed differently i'm gonna show this in today's video so now let's start right away if we have a quick look at gohex.com we can see on the current day 595 we have still a steady total supply of hex 573 billion hex tokens for demo purposes i also made some stakes already earned some decent interests of 0.868 hex so this stake just sits there to show you guys once the snapshot happened once the mainnet is live we will see this stake on our pulse chain as well i still have some liquid hex just to sacrifice dca in over time every day a little bit we will see this as well we have some great new updates on the stat side but for now let's cover first the hex stats if we zoom in a little bit to the t-shirts you can see the daily close price in usd came down a little bit yesterday one t-shirt was 2754 dollars and if we scroll down a little bit more you can see also the daily payout per t-shirt and you can see we are still way above average average is down here around 5.7 hex per t-shirt so yesterday we received 6.32 hex this is pretty damn amazing and it results in an apy of 41.7 percent if we move Move on to hexinfo.io you can see the imported market data for hex compared to the us dollar hex is now up 280,703x compared to bitcoin we are up 68,118x and compared to ethereum we are up 20,944x wonderful stats move on to graphhex.rocks you can see the numbers are going crazy we have now 9.546 percent of the total circulating supply staked 0.21 9% of all the hex existing are sacrificed. Yesterday, this number was below 0.1%. Now it's already 0.2%. This is just crazy. As well, we can observe the liquidity on the Uniswap pools. So you can see 48 million on the version 2 and 17 million on the version 3. Some Ethereum is left on both versions as well. Totally, we have now staked over 9 billion US dollars. The current APY sits at 42.39%. For one hex, it went up a little bit you have now to pay 15 cents already. One t-shirt at the moment costs you around $2,868 and you can check the price down here. You have two charts, you can see in yellow the t-shirt price, this is what matters, and you can see the hex price. After the recent little correction, we just recovered, maybe the bottom is in, maybe it's just a little tiny fake out just to shake out some weak sacrificers, and after that it could go up to higher levels because over 1 billion hex tokens has been sacrificed, but it could also just go sideways or down we will never know this is crypto baby so you will figure it out on your own if you move on to hex.vision you can see on the main page the stakes are getting more and more it's going crazy today we have already 664 stakes in yesterday we closed with 1473 stakes and the day before with 1475 a quick check on the current addresses by the way we just reached over 300,000 addresses holding hex tokens so if we do the math right we should have roughly 1200 new addresses holding hex tokens in the last 24 hours this is just the new wallets so this steady growth is pretty damn bullish if we check the penalty situation 19.5 million hex tokens were paid out to the stakers and the away address thank you very much 0x3 for 7.4 million hex tokens thank you very much 0x a1 for 3.6 million hex tokens and thank you very much 0x27 for 3.5 million hex tokens paid to the staker class thank you for your service let's move on to the gas prices the gas prices are going up and down a little bit all the time you can see this if you zoom into the chart it is spiking up but now we just came down a little bit more and we went around to the range of 30 ways still pretty damn cheap but what will be cheaper is the upcoming pulse chain you will expect 
experience this once it is out. Let's check quickly the charts. We can see we have some sideways actions in the last two days, but you can also observe that the spikes to the upside are quite heavily. We are going to the range of 22, even some 27 cents, and this could be just a signal that hex is once again before an explosion. If we're gonna visualize this with our random lines, I just wanna show you, maybe we're just gonna continue to trade in this range a couple days, but for all the haters, just from the recent all-time low, we are now up 1,066%, so congratulations for that. Just keep in mind, 1 billion hex tokens just got sacrificed in total and is away from the market. And if we have a quick look at the market in general, the top cryptocurrencies by market cap, we can see some red days again. And I told you guys, if all the cryptocurrencies are red, hex is mostly green, and look at that, up 10%. Bitcoin sits around $30,848, down almost 1.5%. Ethereum chills at $1,826, down 4.4%, and Hex just recovered and is knocking on 16 cent again, up 10%, with a decent market cap of 90 billion US dollars. If we scroll further down, we can see way, way, way down, we have 62 billion with Tether, Binance coins are also there, Cardano, this one, we're gonna sacrifice today together. If we scroll further down, we will maybe find Tron somewhere, but I think Tron is already gone as well. You can now sacrifice Stellar, Matic, Polygon, but maybe where's Tron? Finally, we found Tron on position 13. We're going to sacrifice this as well, just to show you guys how to do it. So now let's come to the sacrifice stats. If you have a quick look and give a refresh to the website on the Ethereum address, which is the sacrifice stuff going to for the Ethereum based tokens, we can observe over 1.38 billion hex tokens were sacrificed so far. This is an amazing and outstanding number. We have 67 million US dollars in US. USDC coin, 20 million in DAI, 8.5 in Tether, 6.9 wrapped Bitcoin and some other tokens as well. If we check quickly how many Ethereum already was sent to this address, we can see 32,933 Ethereum were sent, almost everything was sent out, probably to sell or whatever, have no expectation of the work of others, just enjoy the amount which is going into the sacrifice phase, this will be a steady dollar amount for the upcoming Pulse Chain. So let's quickly check Pulse Chain com congratulations the pulse chain sacrifice phase has started this is nothing new keep in mind after the first five days the rate increases five percent we have now finally also a nice countdown so you can see you have 14 hours to go until the sacrifice phase day five will end and after that the rate will increase you can see this down here how the rate increases over time for the whole 19 days so that's the update for the pulsechain.com website the second update is on pulse.info you can see now if you connect your MetaMask wallet, you open the drop down menu and you can see that we have some new coins added. Binance Chain, Binance Smart Chain are both now in here in the list. We have as well Cardano, EOS, which is new. We have as well Polygon and Stellar Network, as well Tron added to the list. But first, let me do my daily sacrifice on the Ethereum blockchain. For this, I just gonna choose Ethereum in the drop down menu. I'm gonna copy the address which is provided in here. Please double check the address on the social profiles down here and then you hop over to your MetaMask. If you're gonna click the button send, I can paste this address in here, choose hex from my tokens, for example. Let's sacrifice 2000 hex with an average gas fee, hit next, and then we can confirm the transaction and it's gone. Second update I would like to give you is the Pulse Lead XYZ website. This website is just monitoring what's going on on the Ethereum blockchain. We have two countdowns in here as well. The day five ends in roughly 14 hours. The total sacrifice phase ends in 14 days and 13 hours 57 minutes. You have the top leaderboard down here, this is pretty amazing, and by the way Hextopia and your crew is amazing. You have now as well a search function where you can directly search your address, but keep in mind you only see the transactions on the Ethereum blockchain. So for this demo account I already sacrificed $2,455, my actual rank at the moment is 7,727. If we click on view all transactions, we can see all the single transactions actions we have made so far. You have to wait roughly an hour until the latest sacrifice is visible. If you sacrifice other coins, you will not see them in here. So let's go back to pulse.info and now this time I'm going to show you how to sacrifice some Throne and as well some Cardano. We have two different coins and two different processes how to sacrifice, so let's check it out. First, we're going to sacrifice some Tron. So all you do, you have to choose Tron in this drop-down menu. So this is really important. Only send from an address you own the private keys. No exchanges you can 
not sacrifice from an exchange. So you have to hold your Tron in a wallet kind of like MetaMask. Back in the days I used Tron Link and I just found this Tron wallet with 20 bucks on and because I hold the private keys also for this wallet where my Tron sits in, I'm all good. This is not an exchange so let me just copy this address. We open again our Tron wallet, we're gonna click send and we can paste in here the receiving address. We're gonna send the max Tron I have in this wallet, in this case 157 Tron. We're gonna hit send, confirm now the transaction and click accept and the transaction has has been submitted already to the Tron network and is sacrificed. This Tron is gone. You will not get any confirmation about your sacrifice, but you could, for example, copy this address. You just go to a Tron Explorer and you search your sacrifice address. You can see we have in total 138,731 Tron sacrificed. If we go down a little bit, we should see some more transactions. Voila! And here we have an unconfirmed transaction. That's me. We have 157 Tron sacrifice to this address so everything looks pretty good. If we click on the transaction you can also see now after a while it is successfully confirmed. So once again I repeat Tron you cannot sacrifice from exchanges you need to hold your own wallet. In the second example of this tutorial we're gonna sacrifice some Cardano because there are no smart contracts and you can already see this changed a little bit the process to sacrifice. If I zoom in you can read it even better. Send only Cardano to the generated address you can send directly from an exchange change to this address on this chain because you are issued a unique address to send to. You can sacrifice to this address below. So in this example you see Tron you could not sacrifice from an exchange but Cardano you can send directly from an exchange because this is just your address where you sacrifice to. So let's go let's sacrifice some Cardano for this I'm gonna quickly change the screen. I hold still some Cardano on my mobile phone you can see 118 Cardano and if we would like to sacrifice this kind of coins we just gonna click the button and send. I already copied and pasted the address so I can only paste it up in here. Let's choose the amount. Of course you have no max button so let's just go with 118 Cardano. Click button send and we have to enter a password. Wonderful. And you can confirm the transaction right away. Confirm submitting transaction. This will take a little while until the Cardano will reach his destination so let me switch back to our screen. So let's just copy this address. Go to a Cardano blockchain explorer. Paste your address in here. Hit enter and you can see the 118 Cardano was sent to this wallet. So I assume the sacrifice process for Cardano worked well. If we go back, just please really make sure whatever coin you would like to sacrifice, if you would like to sacrifice some Matic, Polygon, only send from an address where you hold the private keys. Again, no exchanges. So please really make sure to read the damn instructions that you sacrifice the right way. And with this, we are already by the end of this video for today. If you found any value in it, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel. This would be really appreciated and helps the channel to grow. Drop a comment down below if you have any questions. Sacrifice a lot, stay long and fat, stay safe out there and see you in the next one. Peace.